Uh, I'm Tom Lin from Denver, martialarts.com. This is my friend David Gonzalez uh, from Seven Ink Miami, tattoo artist. You have any tattoos you want, go there. Uh, today we're going to work on four moves. Uh, one where he has the advantage, then I have the advantage, and me. Um, this is the beauty of Jiu Jitsu yeah. flow. So, what we're going to start with is he hits me in a single leg. Okay? He gets it up. And this is bad for me. Because now at this point he's going to take me down. So, as soon as I feel this happening, one of my defenses is I can kind of sneak my hand in. He's doing it right. So he it's on the side. I grab at his chin like this. And I start working for the guillotine. Okay? So, I'm going to actually put pressure at the crease where his neck meets his chin. Okay? And I'm going to put pressure up. So when I go to fall to like take him down, he jumps to the other side, which is good for him, bad for me, because no longer is my guillotine is really that effective. So now he has a move called the Von Flu, which he puts his hand behind my back, grabs his hands, and he's gonna put pressure on the shoulder, but wait, and then he's gonna get me. But as soon as I feel him jump to that side, my option is to kind of take this hand, feed that far side collar to this hand. Okay, so as soon as I feel him jump over, I feed it, I grab that collar, and even when he starts to try and put pressure, I spin under him, and I choke him. With this loop choke here, this is what's happening. Okay, so it's like a guillotine, but with the gi. Okay, so one more time. So he goes for the single, boom, I feed for the guillotine. I would really like him to be on that side, but as soon as I fall, he feels it, he jumps to the opposite side. Right, so as soon as I feel that, I'm gonna switch my grip because he's gonna do the Von Flu on me. Okay? I switch to that D and I start spinning under him with the, with the D pulling across. Okay? Awesome.